Hello everyone, I am Ghulam Abbas. I hope you guys are fine and doing great. Today in this video, I am going to show you how to reset the forgotten Windows 10 password. So let's get started. Uh, here you can have a look here. I have already installed a Windows 10 inside the VMware, which is also the Windows 10 version 19.02. So you can have a look here. I am in the login page and if I have to type the password, it is saying that it is wrong the password is wrong so it is a local account if you have a Microsoft account then for a Microsoft account you have to visit the Microsoft.com that doesn't matter if that is inside your mobile device tablet iPhone or your computer or any other another computer just uh, type that your email address of the Microsoft account and then uh, select forget password and after that you have to reset that one easily and they will send a link inside the email of yours then you can reset the email if that is an online account but if there is not an online account there are three methods by which you can reset the windows 10 password so you can have a look here the very first thing here if i have to click reset password then uh, let me make it full screen it will ask from you three questions now these are the three questions when you have installed windows uh, if you have remembered them just go ahead and enter and then it will reset the password Okay, if you have not remembered that one there is also another thing use a password reset disk instead so you can have a look at this is uh, a USB disk which you are creating uh, Inside the windows. So let me I have to show you that is inside control panel. It is uh, it used to be It is still from the older version. I think from the Windows 7 so the uh, user accounts there is an option uh, by which sorry not that one user accounts so here you can have a look here it says create a password reset disk uh, if you have to attach the USB uh, flash drive and then it will create a password reset disk and whenever you forgot your password then you can simply uh, attach the USB and then uh, you can easily go ahead and reset the password uh, of your computer if there's a local account so let me have to connect it to the uh, host and rather the virtual machine and then I will select create a password reset disk you can have a look here it have already uh, detected the USB flash drive so the steps are easy just go ahead and simply click next uh, type the current user password by which you are logged in okay now it's done this is how easily uh, later when you come inside the uh, to reset your password then that time you can easily attach the USB flash drive and you just go ahead and attach the USB uh, that will reset the USB okay there is another thing as I said before that reset option here is also the three question which you must answer uh, for a local account if you have not remembered so let, let me have a look here I have remembered uh, the questions I have all, all of them now because I really had Cortana I have typed those names however it's just a virtual machine that's why I use this one so if I have to look okay then it's saying me telling me that you have to type a new password so here is the new password again retype and enter now you can have a look here it is logging in inside the Windows 10 if it is a local account now there is another thing there is another thing in case if you completely forgotten your Windows password you do not have remembered the security questions you also do not have a USB flash drive to reset the Windows 10 password so how to reset it well there are methods by which you can easily reset it so to do that one uh, you need a bootable Windows 10 uh, that doesn't matter if that is an ISO file sorry if that is a DVD or if that is a USB flash drive doesn't matter any of them can work so since I am running uh, inside the VMware workstation pro I will just go ahead and demonstrate everything for you you can have a look here I have already attached the Windows 10 ISO here so that's why there is no need for me to create a bootable USB that's why I have added the uh, Windows 10 ISO so I'm going to restart the system uh, I mean the virtual machine and then I will press the F12 to get to the uh, place where we 
or about to select a new language for the Windows 10. So just go ahead and restart the system. Here you have to press the boot key of your computer. For now, the boot key of the virtual machine, that is the F12. So I have pressed that one. So here you have to select the USB flash drive of yours. It will be the CD-ROM slash DVD. So it is by default, I'm going to, and now it will take to the place where we are about to install a clean uh, perform a clean installation of windows so but we are not performing a clean installation instead we are just resetting the password so here you can have a look here that we are here in, in the page where it says windows 10 setup so here you have to press windows plus shift uh, Windows plus F10 and then the administrator uh, it will open now here we can have a look at that it is written X uh, semicolon and then the resources here after pressing the shift F10 you have to uh, locate the drives it means how many drives you have inside your computer so that command is fsutil fsinfo and then drives so the not drivers drives You can have a look here i have three drives one is the c d and the x so by default it will be two because x won't be counted so i have to you have to find the drive c uh, so let me check if it is drive c so just go ahead type c and then semicolon and enter now you can have a look here just easily type dir if it is drive c then you will uh, see these uh, folder directories perflux program files and then program files x86 users windows and the other stuffs if that is not the uh, drive c then you have to go back and check the other drives the other drive is d just go ahead again type dir and then you will see that it is not the drive c which i am looking so again i will press drive c and now you can have a look here again i will press dir and i will be back here so once you pause that command <coughs> Now we need to move inside the uh, directory of Windows and then inside the directory of Windows there is a directory called System32. So to do that one easily type CD and then type WN, WIN and then tap, uh, press tap on the keyboard. After that one you have to press enter. Now you can have a look here you are one, uh, one folder forward CD slash Windows. Again you have to type CD. And now SYS and again tap, again tap. Now you can have a look here. It is written system 32 and now enter. Okay. Once you are inside the system 32, we need to uh, copy the utilman. Uh, sorry, uh, utilman is basically the narrator inside. Whenever you are trying to log in, there is a screen keyboard. On screen keyboard and the other stuff uh, we need just to take back of that one so to take backup just type ran you till man you till man dot exe after that one type you till man dot bkp it means backup okay it took the backup now what you have to do instead of the util man you have to pass the uh, cmd.exe type down copy after copy cmd and then tap it will bring by default the exe and now easily select type u tillman dot exe and now enter okay one file has been copied and now just go ahead and restart your system so i'll close this one and i'll also close it and select yes and then your system will restart
so here you can have a look here I am here so just go ahead click on the narrator now instead of the narrator you can have a look at that it brought the uh, command prompt in other words the CMD so now what you have to do you have to uh, find out how many users are inside your computer so to do that one side type simply net user it will list all the user inside your computer you can have a look here there is a user by the name of a boss and an administrator and then a guest and a default account so the user which i am about to log in is known as a boss so just go ahead select net user type sorry type net user and then type the user account after the user account simply type the password for now i'm going to type one two and three and now enter you can have a look here that the command completed successfully okay once it is done just go ahead and close it and now type the password one two and three you can have a look here one two and three and enter Ta-da! it is how you can reset the forgotten password if that is a local account so let me uh, summarize it this one there are three uh, methods by which you can reset a forgotten windows 10 password the first one was actually uh, if you have forgotten uh, if you have remembered the security questions just go ahead and type those security questions uh, like this one if you have remembered those security questions just go ahead type them and then uh, hit this one or enter on the keyboard it will reset the password uh, if you have not remembered that one just go ahead and uh, if you have already taken years created a USB reset disk as I showed you how I created a USB disk with, uh, from the control panel attach this one and it will reset or if you have forgotten that one just go ahead and do what just create a bootable USB after that one uh, boot your computer into the for, for performing clean installation inside the clean installation don't do anything just press the shift f10 then look at the drive c then copy uh sorry back up the back up this uh, narrator and then after that one uh instead of that one you have to pass the command prompt instead of, instead of that one after that one you have to come restore the computer and type there here net user after net user you will have a look here that here are the, here are the users now easily type net user after net user select the user account which you want which you want to reset them just go ahead and then type the password which you want which you want to type and then click enter it is easily reset now that is this is how you can reset the windows 10 forgotten password so if you have liked this video if it is helpful for you just go ahead and don't forget to hit like comment and also subscribe to into guide channel so till next time have a nice time and goodbye